All right, everyone, I'm going to talk about different value volume pots and how they affect the tone of your guitar pickup, why they affect the tone of your guitar pickup, and how to use that to your advantage. Quick backstory, I used to be a guitar tech at a couple of big box stores and a couple of mom and pop stores. People would come in with Les Paul saying that their neck pickup was too muddy or come in with a Strat or Tele saying that their pickups were too bright. Instead of changing out their guitar pickups, I would change the value of their volume pot, and nine times out of 10, that was enough. For a Les Paul, I would change the 500K pot to a 1000K pot. That would make the pickup a little bit brighter and less muddy. I would do the opposite for a Strat or Tele. I would lower the 250K pot to a 100K. That would make the pickup slightly warmer. And again, nine times out of 10, that was enough. This is a one make pot. So 1000K, I opened up the back so we can see the operation. Your guitar pickup goes here. The ground goes here. And the center is the wiper. Now, when you plug your guitar pickup into here, your guitar is under constant load. So this is a 1000K pot, so your pickup would be under 1000K load. It wouldn't matter where you put the wiper. This is a variable resistor, but your pickup does not get a variable load. The only variance is the center wiper, which is why you can't use a 1000K pot, put it in the middle, and call it a 500K pot, or three quarters of the way and call it a 250K pot. That's not how it works. It's always a 1000K pot. It's always under 1000K load. The center is only introducing ground to the signal. All right, I have a five-way rotary switch here, so I can switch between 1000K, 500K, 250K, 100K, and 25K. I'm going to play a couple of riffs on the bass strings and on the treble strings. I will go through the different values and we can hear the difference it has on the tone. You can use that to your advantage to tweak out any pickups or guitars that you have. <laughs> 